And just to help people to understand what this electron transport chain is, it's molecules. There's four molecules that are embedded in the inner membrane of the mitochondria. Okay. And the way that the energy is actually created is very similar to what you would see in a relay race. Everyone's seen a relay race where you have the runner and they pass a baton to the next runner who passes it to the next runner and they try to cross the finish line first. Well, in the electron transport chain, instead of runners, you have these protein molecules. And instead of passing a baton, they pass an electron. Okay. Okay. So, and instead of crossing the finish line, the goal is to get to this final stage, which is called cytochrome C oxidase, where we'll talk about this because you need oxygen to, and that's when ATP is produced. So as long as the electrons are passed, like in a race from one of the proteins, you get ATP. But here's what happens. When you start to have too many free radicals, which occur from a variety of reasons, stress, EMF, toxins, kind of things, yeah. the electron transport chain where the molecules are you know, supposed to be close to one another, they cause damage. And so when the mitochondria get damaged, it expands. And when it expands, those runners, the molecule, get further and further and further apart from one another.